with Focus on the 615 and we have been shopping today with Katie Armiger and just hanging out. Now we're going to sit down and ask her a few questions, get to know a little more about her. So we've been shopping all day. What would you say describes your personal style when you're going out versus on stage, <laughs> all of that? It's very different. Yeah. Uh, if, if I'm just at home, I'm probably wearing jeans and a t-shirt. Um, I'm just running around town doing errands. Uh, if it's on stage, I kind of, I like going for a dark, glamorous look. I love black. I don't, that's not a color, I know. But I love <laughs> black. Uh, I love accessorizing. So I always go for more basic pieces. And then I put on really fun shoes or jewelry. Um, but it's, yes, very different from when I'm at home versus on stage. Mm -hmm. Yes, I understand that. Are there any designers you tend to wear a lot, or is it just all over the map? Well, I'm going to choose Leona now after shopping right? here. I know. <laughs> yeah. uh, I love it. Uh, I would say it really ranges. Um, I can wear everything from free people or something super nice to I will wear things I find at Target that I like. Mm -hmm. Very big variety. Yes, I am I'm with you on that. Love me some Target. So, um, obviously music, big for you, singing, songwriting. So what do you do with all that for like charity work? And what's important to you as far as that goes? Yeah, well I just, I really love giving back. Uh, I'm involved with a few different charities. Um, Hear the Music Live is one that I've worked with for a few years, as well as St. Jude. Uh, I've toured the hospital a few times, uh, and I'm also a partner in Hope. Uh, and I just recently uh, started working with musicians on call, and uh, that's a, here in Nashville, and you go to different hospitals and you sing to the children, and just try to, try to encourage them and give them some hope. So have you done that already, like gone and sang for children, or? You just work with them for other people to do that. <laughs> I made it through the interview process. Okay. You would think that it would be, you, you have to make sure that, uh, they, they have to make sure that you're okay to, to do that. Right. Um, yeah. But I actually have my first visit scheduled for this month. So I'm really, really excited. I've, I've toured hospitals before um, for Christmas, like singing Christmas carols and doing mm -hmm. that sort of thing, uh, but not with an official organization. So. Well, that's very exciting. Thank I'll have you. to, you'll have to let me know how it goes. I will. I'm, yeah. I'm nervous. I mean, children are, when you sing to children, some of them really like it, but some of them also are really ill, and uh, you have to realize that uh, they don't want to hear music sometimes, and they also enjoy being able to say no because there are so many decisions that they're not always able to make especially if they're really ill and so just being able to say yes or no is, is a really big one for them so yeah. sometimes they're like do you want me to sing no <laughs> no I don't no I don't but I mean I have six siblings so I'm used yeah. to that it doesn't bother me at all I'm not offended yeah yeah well that sounds great that's a really great thing for yeah, you to be doing. doing and yeah I'm sure that even if they say no they'll come <laughs> and say yes and really love it <laughs> so who who inspires you? Who do you look up to as a role model or just a mentor, anything like that? Mm, I would have to say, as far as a career that I would want to emulate, uh, either Dolly or Reba. Mm -hmm. uh, because they've been around for so many years and they're still around and they're still such a big presence. And, you know, they're great artists and all that, but they're also really smart businesswomen which I like. Yes, yeah, that's important too. So what do you have coming up next as far as any new songs coming out, concerts, what's going on in that side of your life? Yeah, well I have a new album out that's called Fall Into Me and uh, right now I'm just traveling around touring, uh, promoting the album. Yes, yeah. So I'm actually leaving tonight for a show in Florida and uh, we're gonna continue touring throughout the fall. And when does your CD come out? It's out right now. So oh, if you okay. if you go to katiearmager.com, uh, it will link you to all the sites where you can buy it, or you can just go to Walmart or whatever stores in your area. All right, I will have to check it out later. Yes, I listened do. to your song earlier today, 
and I really enjoyed it. So thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. Yeah, well, it's been great sitting down with you today. I got to it's been great ask some shopping great with questions. you. Yeah, I, I know we picked up some pretty good outfits. You'll have to come I'm gonna, back to I'm that. gonna walk out with it. They're gonna yeah, be like, Wait, I know. We're just gonna sneak out really quick. <laughs> They're not gonna know where we went. You'll have to grab that red coat on the way out. Just saying. <laughs> well, thank you. It's been great getting to chat with you and shop with you. And I wish you the best of luck in your concert and with your CD and everything else you do. Thank you. It was great meeting you.